and welcome to my channel. It's Jess with Love to Plan with Jess. And today we're going to do a flip through of my planners for the month of March. We have three planners here. This is my wellness planner, my catch-all planner, and social media planner. I franken plan, so they all sit in this planner um, for the current month and I just have this one planner that sits on my desk and each month I take the sections out of here and put it back into the original planner and then I'll take the next month and put it into this one. Um, so I think for the month of May I will probably show that part of or show that in this video too. I'll show how I move things back and forth from my Franken planner to the original planners. So this month, let's start with my wellness planner. So I use a Kelva plan uh, planner for my wellness and I didn't fill any of this in. Oh man. Uh, so I created this um, currently page for March and I don't think that this was a video. I don't think that I did this um, as a YouTube video, but I really liked this idea instead of, for my wellness planner, usually I'll do like self-care ideas or something that um, has like a theme of self-care. And this month I did I statements. I can, I think, I love, I want, and I feel. And now that I realize that I didn't fill this in, I need to go back and do that. These stickers came from the Kelva Plan Hello Spring, I believe, these little Easter ones. This is my monthly, and these stickers came from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop, uh, the volume one sticker book. I love how this spread came out. Um, in my monthly for my wellness, I fill in the workout that I do for the day in each box. Um, and if I don't work out, then I put rest day or um, something else. My kiddo was sick in the beginning of the month. Um, I had come home from a business trip and he got sick. So the first few days I didn't, didn't work out. And this is the first week of March. Uh, these stickers came from Live Love Posh. Was it fruits and florals? Might have been fruits and florals. I really like how the spread came out too. I love this like purpley and yellow um, combination. And this is the next week. These stickers came from Amber Plants Her Day, the fan favorite sticker book. And I love these little pandas. I think they're adorable. And the next week, these are Plenty Thing, and this came from the new spring sticker book. This was the first day of spring, I think like on the 19th maybe, and was so excited that spring, spring was on the way and um, just getting ready for nice weather. And this was the week of Easter, so I used where did these come from? I think these were Live Love Posh, but don't quote me on that. I think that they were Live Love Posh. Um, I love these stickers also. I really like how the spread came out. Very pastel, very Easter. And this was my wellness challenge for March. I had four weeks and each week I did an upper body workout, a hit and heels ride, a lower body workout, a choice ride, which means like any kind of ride um, on my Peloton, a full body workout, and then a sweat steady ride. And I did really well on this challenge. I completed it. This was my March sleep tracker. I had a lot of, um, a lot of this like eight hours or more, which, which was great. Um, April, not so much. I know April is not, has not been a good month for sleep so far. Uh, this was my mood tracker and, uh, I was in a pretty good mood all month long. And this was my habit tracker. I tracked five habits, uh, working out, reading, not having any soda, taking a magnesium supplement, and sleeping seven or more hours a night. Um, taking the magnesium supplement, I am thinking that's why my 
sleep was so much better this month. I did stop taking it at the end of March and um, started taking it again. This is the, I don't know, the second week of April. Um, and I really do think that that was impacting my sleep for the better taking that supplement. So, um, so I started taking it again. So that was my wellness planner. So let's move on to my catch-all. So again, I didn't fill in how I was feeling for March, but I filled everything else in for my currently page. Um, this is just your standard currently page with currently prompts. Um, I loved this. Uh, I loved this currently page, how this one turned out. And this was also Live Love Posh, I believe. I can't remember which book. This was my monthly spread for March and I used some scrapbook paper and sort of lined the um, the borders. I changed up the days of the week and the dates with some Planner Kate uh, stickers and I used some Amber Plans Her Day um, St. Patrick's Day stickers in here. This was the first week of March. Um, again, these were Live Love Posh stickers and I think this came from maybe the Spring Elements book. I think so. Uh, Spring Forward was on Sunday. I love when it starts to get uh, to stay light later. Oh, I was watching this series, Wolf Like Me. This was a really interesting one. It was on Peacock, I think. And this was St. Patrick's uh, Day, the week of St. Patrick's Day. Um, I love how this spread turned out too. This was from Amber Plants Her Day, these stickers. And these boxes were Mojo Jojo plants, I think in her, maybe her spring 2.0 book. And the next week, this was the first day of spring and I used Live Love Posh. Uh, I think this was Spring Allure. And this was really a really fun spread. And the last week of March, uh, this came from, these butterflies came from, I think these came from the Amber Plans Her Day Spring Essentials. Uh, and this was a very different spread for me. Um, doing something like this where having the butterflies, you know, fly across the page and sort of cluster in the boxes. Um, but I love how this turned out. I think that this one came out really cool. We were on vacation this week for my son's spring break. We went to Atlantic City. It was really fun. We did an escape room. We didn't escape, but we had a really, really good time. It was so much fun. And that's going to do it for my catch-all planner. And finally, we have my social media planner. Uh, these stickers were from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop. Um, I got her advent calendar, the, like, I think it was called the luxury one. It was the one that only had 12 um, instead of, I think the other one had 24 maybe. Um, but I love these. I've been using them a lot in my currently pages, and I think that they're so pretty. And this was my monthly. The way that I use my monthly for my social media planner is to just put like which what videos I'm going to post each day and then I like highlight them when I um, post them once I film them and upload them. And like these two, you can see I didn't highlight them. I didn't end up posting these. I typically will post uh, Sunday through Friday and I don't have any videos that go up on Saturday. Every once in a while I will. These stickers came from the Amber Plants Her Day fan favorites. It's like a Harry Potter vibe. I thought these were really fun. And these came from Hell of a Plan. This was her seasonal sticker book, the St. Patrick's Day stickers. Sunday was St. Patrick's Day. I think this was my first social media um, YouTube video that I posted, and these came from Live Love Posh. I absolutely love these stickers. I think that they are so pretty, and like the watercolor and the colors, I just, I loved this, um, this spread. 
Uh, these stickers came from Plenty Thing. This was in her spring book and uh, Easter was on Sunday and so I decorated with an Easter theme. So that is the flip through for my three of my planners. Um, I don't typically show flip throughs of my journal um, or my work planner. My work planner um, has you know confidential information on it, so that one I can't share. Um, and my journal I haven't shared on YouTube yet. I may in the future. Um, we'll see. But um, for now, it's these three planners that I am sharing in these flip throughs. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.